Hello guys, <laughs> and we are back with more Alpha Bikini Bottom, and my my stupid iPhone decided to die while I was recording, and I died exactly at this part, I mean, I died, my phone died at this part right here, as I was, I got the golden spatula at the end of this Gilligan uh, Sea Caves, and I walked out of here, but I got, I went ahead and got Patrick, because I was Thought I was still recording, but I wasn't. Good thing I looked up and didn't get anything off screen. So, this is how you get the sock over here. I'm not sure if I can get it in time where I don't die, but if I die, so be it. Well, I already got a checkpoint, so I gotta do it back up there. Good thing I don't have to get that again, because I'm Patrick. Patrick can't do that. Bubble move. But yeah, sorry about that, like, all of a sudden. But I guess that was a good part to stop, was uh, getting the golden spatula. Which, now I have 25. Which is pretty good, and that was a really short, uh... So, we're back on track. And what we're about to do is talk to Mr. Krabs. How, how many socks have we got? Seven? That's pretty good. Um... It's funny how you can hit the char other characters in the game just around here. I think we talked to Mr. Krabs with Patrick. Sorry. Yep. But the carnival is closed. What? A pesky robot has taken over me ticket booth. And worse. Me money. Ah, oh, he took over his ticket booth. If you help me get rid of the robot, I'll give you <clears> a big reward. Like what? What the heck? Patrick didn't even talk. So, what we need to do is take care of this robot. And they couldn't make it any more obvious. <clears throat> and you're thinking, and all, it's that simple to get a um, golden spatula, just kill this robot right here? Um, well, I'll just wait and see. Nah, we just kind of made things worse. <laughs> You can already see what our work is planned out for us. So yeah. What we gotta do is go back to talking to Mr. Krabs. And see what he wants us to do. Because obviously that's not what he wanted us to do. We helped, but we hurt. Exactly what I had in mind. <laughs> I hope my insurance covers all this. Yeah, for real. Why don't you try something less expensive? Or, I mean, dangerous. Yeah. I need them crazy robots cleared out of the bumper boats. Oh, okay. So we gotta get all the way over there, pretty much. That's our task is to get all, all the way over there. And, and we get random shiny objects. Once again, Patrick does not want to talk. So what abs. Okay. So it's not that hard to get over there. And um I guess we could ride on this um neat looking ride. It's like a Ferris wheel, but with no barrier to protect you, jeez, you just fall off and die. But no one probably wants to ride that because this place is pretty much destroyed because of the robots. Well, my fault. Okay, here's a little mini game. This is actually a mini game, so. What I said earlier was halfway true. This is like whack a mole, but you just hit the tiki's with your belly. And you can only use Patrick to do it because you don't have the throw fruit. It's pretty simple. Uh, how many do I have to do? Oh, you just have to do all of them. You have to do them until they stop coming up. So. Oh. And the rewards of sock, whoop de doo. But it's a cool little mini game. I wish this game had more mini games, but more it's just like a adventure, you gotta go get stuff. Do stuff. Alright. You can see there's a um golden spatula down there. Just for you know walking through this place, but oh no, that's you get it with a freezy fruit. Uh, it's a Scotty Potty. 
Well, that's what they're called around here, but I could, it's a port ahead. Like a Mott's Pot, Scotty Potties, you know. It's cool how they just have like a little rise on here. Kind of reminds me of, um, I don't want this to be spoilers, but um, if you never played SpongeBob SquarePants The Flying Dutchman, in The Flying Dutchman, you know, that's what it's called, is the game right before this one. Um, they have like rides and stuff like that, just like familiar with like like Plankton's uh, amusement park. I forget what it's called, but this is what it reminds me of, which is pretty neat. But of course, it has a lot more rides. That game seems like it's more in detail. I don't know, but of course, I like this game more. Oh, here's another mini game up here, but we can't do it just yet. It's really fun though. These platform jumps ain't that hard. Yeah, we're not gonna read that because it's a spoiler. But you need SpongeBob to do it. And if you actually jump in there, the hand will take you away. It's like what the heck, man? It's like I just want to go in there. Well, oh, you can't. Is there something behind here? I just like looking around everywhere because I'm like. I like to double check everything. Especially at work. Like, I, I count the money. Like, if I do a safe drop, I count the money twice. Oh, what's this? Is there a socket at the end of this? Oh, you gotta carry the throw fruit all the way down without getting hit. Which is very familiar to another mission you gotta do later on in the game. Oh, that going you. I think it's probably for a sock, but, um, just kind of avoid them. You don't want to kind of avoid them. Oh, and I, oh, of course I die. But the sock should still be there. So. Keep my iPhone charged, but jeez, die at 25%. You get 25 more percent before you die. I mean, I understand if it dies at 10%, that's pretty low. But, like, 25 really and when I plugged it in it was at 29 geez enough of my rain okay this one you oh this one's kind of hard kind of want to jump to it but once before it gets there so you have enough time to land on it before it leaves okay now what's this about do you want to pay the oh this is for the bungee jump thing. Yeah. We'll pay you. What? No, is, is it a bungee jump? What are you implying? Yeah, it's a bungee jump. He needs SpongeBob. I guess, yeah, we'll just go ahead and go back and go switch to him. We'll just skip over this way. And probably die so we can get to back to the checkpoint. Which, hopefully, it's close by. So, at least we got this. And this video will be longer than last because... Okay. Yeah, don't read that. <laughs> if you saw that, don't read it. This will be the longer than last part because... Of course, my phone died in the last part. This just died. Or did I just get a checkpoint? I'm stupid. Oh, well. It's close, just get to it. Like I said, oh, I don't know if I said it last video, but I'm pumped about the Bengals game. They play the Steelers tonight. And no one's like real familiar with football and rivals and stuff. That is the Bengals' biggest rival is the Steelers. Can't stand them. Yep, we get another spatula. I'm not going to worry about the Tiki's. And 25 golden spatulas. I like to, I like to say how like what landmark that is in the game, but I'm not going to. I'm just I'm just going to say there's a lot of spatulas in this game. So once okay, we did the bungee jump. Bungee jumps are easy. Just sometimes I make you pay. The jellyfish filled ones. I don't think it did. Can't remember. 
um, Madam Fishy Fortune Teller. Toss a clam, prizes, games. Looks like a theme park. Oh, there is a sock up here, jeez. Wow. Huh, that's funny. And just some shiny object back here. They even put a trampoline back here? That's pretty neat. Huh, I like that. Alright, what the? You, oh, you have to do the slide. Yeah, the slide's pretty fun. And let me turn up the volume. Okay, that's too low. Just enough sitting here. Yeah, you probably can hear that. A little bit more. I hope hurt myself. Oh well. That's how you get that purple shiny object. That's worth 50 shiny objects. And... We're already down here. Uh, yeah, we need Patrick to do that. Jeez, we got like... Four bus stops within like two areas. We Lagoon puts a lot of bus stops. There's at least six. I guess you take care of them. I don't really matter. I'm gonna do it with SpongeBob because I think we need SpongeBob for right after this part. No, nope. might as well do uh, Patrick because we get that golden spatula to do with the crazy bird. You just make sure you don't run into the um, bumper cars. And then once you're done, you need to go to Mr. Krabs and he'll give it to you. Which you, oh yeah, you have to be Patrick. So, that makes sense. So just jump back in. Let's talk to Mr. Krabs. I guess these are freezy fruit, yeah. Here is your reward. Heck yeah, man. And Patrick once again doesn't talk. Talk, Patrick. There he talked. I don't want to turn it down. Hold one sec. <coughs> Okie doke, so... Since we got that out of the way... We shall do the freezy fruit. I'm going special. This is kind of hard. You have to time it right. I mean, you, don't, you can't really just take your time. Am I really almost done with Goo Lagoon? Oh my goodness. Dang, this game is going by a lot quicker than I thought. Because this is part 10, and I'm almost done with Goo Lagoon. Man, that's crazy. Okay, you just got to pretty much watch where you're going. And make the most of your time because they're not going to give you a lot of time. I guess you can go ahead and strategize and pick up some throw fruit. Oh, did I? No! Oh, it broke? Okay. I didn't time that right. Oh well. Let's try it again. Up we go. Okay. Yeah, it's probably just best just to wait on this one. I don't think there's a sock down here, too. They won't put a sock in to go in the go down here. So. Okay, let's get it this time. You can hear the um, ice breaking. Ice, ice, baby, to go, to go. Ice, ice, baby, to go. Getting golden spatulas left and right, man. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, okay. I guess that'll be a part. Um, let's at least get back over there, and then we'll say that we'll call that an episode. I don't know why, but I thought there was a sock. I guess we could just look. I'm pretty sure there's a sock over here. Cause... Oh no, there isn't, because that last one just you could do um, was SpongeBob's last move, so man. Are we on a roll or what? 
There's probably like a shiny object over yonder or somewhere. So, I'll stop here and set, well, I point and save it, but I'll save it anyway. Use the Patrick Teeter Tower to go to the island in the Gulagoon Beach. And we will do that in the next part. So, I'll see you guys then. And I can't believe this game is going by that quick. It's crazy. Um, probably, I'm just going to guess, 35 parts. It's just going by with a breeze. Anywhere from 35 to 40. So I'll see you at the next part, and we'll go out to that beach and finish off Gulagoon. So I'll see you guys later. Josh 17, Jared 27, signing out.